Let's talk about bucket lists because there's a lot of people that have them and a lot of things that we'd like to do. There's a new survey out from Choice Mutual Insurance revealing the most common things on Americans' bucket list. So maybe no surprise here, travel's dominating with number one and number two. Mm -hmm. Okay, so number one is like travel to Europe, mm -hmm. actually specific landmarks in Europe. So I'm assuming like, people want to visit the Eiffel Tower. Mm -hmm. Is that kind of what you're assuming on that one? I would imagine because, I mean, you know, like going to Paris and yeah. some of these places that are much talked mm -hmm. about, um, you know, it's an expensive trip, so mm -hmm. I'm sure it's probably yeah. on a list for folks if I can ever get there. Right. You grow up like seeing all these photos and books, at, you know, in school or through movies. So I feel like, like the Eiffel Tower, especially. I was like, especially good after the it's Olympics, like, where yeah. they had the rings on it and it's they had like, all those beautiful shots. I gotta put that on the bucket list. Yeah. I need to be there. It's been part of your like kind of interest uh, for your whole life. Yep. Right. Number two is visiting specific landmarks in North America. So mm -hmm. I'm assuming that's something maybe like the Grand Canyon. Yeah, I could see that. Yeah. Um, places that you see or hear people talk about, mm -hmm. but you just haven't had a chance to make that trip. For Mount sure. Rushmore. No, yeah. Mount Rushmore. Yeah, that's yes. a good one. That's, that's kind of tucked one. in. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Statue of Liberty, things like mm -hmm. that. Mm -hmm. uh, number three, not a travel one, learn a new language. Is that on either of your bucket lists? <sighs> yeah, but I feel like I'm too far out now. Yeah. It's like, <laughs> Do I'm I want to come at the time? Do I even <laughs> learn the same way? I've been so intrigued by trying to pick up maybe a language from high school, trying to do the whole app and stuff, but you just really had to put time into it. Oh, yes. 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 You have to keep up with it. Yeah. Uh, Sheila, number four was, you said, was that was kind of a, a surprise to Become you. Become a millionaire. Yeah. I've never thought of it necessarily it's, being on a bucket list, that's but it's kind of like one of those things that people say mm -hmm. from time to time. Oh, I wish I was a millionaire, but right. I never thought about putting like, it on the bucket that's list. That's on your bucket list. Yeah. Yes. And number five, travel via cruise. Oh, yeah. Okay. Now, our good friend here, Shayla, has already done number 14. Ah. Write a book. Oh, okay. oh yeah. yeah. We yes. knocked that one out. You already, yes. you already got that one out of the way. I got that one out of the ring. Yeah. The one that I did um, like, and I was like, oh, you could see that being on a bucket list, mm -hmm. building a house. Oh, that's really? Like, oh, yeah. Yes, that's, that's, a, that's a whole. That's a yes, yes. Now, when we say building a house, are you talking about like designing the vision and someone else like hammering? Oh yeah, <laughs> okay. no, no hammering no here. No physical labor going no on. No physical labor from okay. this end. But yeah. just, you know, getting through the process. Okay. Yeah. Yes, like yes. Um, home. Mine is a lot more scaled back. All I want to do is ride a hot air balloon. I've been, that's just been like on that. my bucket list oh for, it's been on my bucket list for a very long time. Um, we almost got to do it when we were out in um, Arizona, my husband and I, and then just, you know, it. It's so weather dependent mm -hmm. that you know it wasn't it wasn't in the cards that day. They have the hot balloon uh, festival in Albuquerque that I've always yeah. wanted to see where. It well, goes they have through. some cool stuff out in Hudson too. Yeah, so for sure, that's my hope. Yeah, that's a good one. Um, Joseph also knows Pizza Farm is on my bucket list. That is. <laughs> so mine, know? mine are really. I mean, I don't need the Eiffel Tower. I just yeah, want a nothing, Pizza Farm. Nothing too yeah. extravagant. Um, yeah. What is yours? What's your bucket list item? I was thinking about this earlier, and I had mm -hmm. a good idea, and then it completely slipped my mind in the pressure of all of this. Oh, so okay. I've had some like bucket list concerts that I've wanted oh, to go okay. to. Oh, okay. That's like, a that's a, that's number ten. That was on actually. It. Or like um, maybe going to see them at certain uh, locations as well. Like Red Rocks in Colorado yeah. is really popular. So like things like that. Like the Sphere. Yeah. Yep. The in sphere. Vegas. Oh, there you go. That's on my bucket list now. What about skydiving hmm. for you? Whew, that used to be on my bucket list. Did you do it? I got a little older, Shayla. Yeah. Oh, you got a little wiser. It didn't happen. A little okay. wiser. <laughs> there, but I've learned how there, there becomes an age where you just say, oh, well, I'll just do it. Right, remember, and I remember the, like, the all the stories we do about like the 95-year-old yeah. skydiving. So just hold <laughs> that on. Might, that'll hold be on. you. Yeah. <laughs>